Controversy TV, we get into everything, right? So we want we want a little fun side, yeah. We want you to share with the Bahamian people who watching, because you know we didn't have the hardest show Lincoln. Mm -hmm. The most rated show on cable TV, you know it like three times as much now. Number now. one. We got the man on the show today. Tell us how you met or what happened the first time when you met your beautiful wife. <laughs> we won't know that. You still think she's beautiful? It's <laughs> <laughs> very beautiful outside. <laughs> <laughs> Life, you know, you, you, you live and you learn. How did you meet him? Well, we, we, we met in, in Atlanta at the uh, Trumpet Awards. I was receiving the Global Trumpet Award, mm -hmm. and she was presenting, not to me, but she was making a, a, another presentation. And we happened to have met, um, to be sitting at the same table, and small chat, exchanging numbers. Uh, staying what, what line you? What line you? you yeah, tell me how to catch a movie star. I want, I want to stop. He caught <laughs> diamond. You're a diamond. He caught her. <laughs> tell me, you sitting at a table with a movie star. You know? What did you? What did you? What did you say to her? Well, she was sitting. She was sitting at the table uh, with the head of government. Mm. <laughs> oh, 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 mm. Okay, all right, all right. The Cinderella story. Uh, and, uh, so, you know, we, we, we correspond with we, we had a real first date in, in Jamaica. Mm. Um, she, she was there on, she was in Jamaica, and I went, I went there to, uh, to take her out, and then I bought her back to Turks and Caicos, and um, we started a courtship, and about two months later, I, I don't know, I must have lost my mind. Two months later, I, I proposed and... Uh, what? Yeah. You accidentally said two months. Two months later. Now you met two years. Two months later, I proposed. We were married for two years. Wow. And we, and we, we dated for a year. And, um, and so... Uh, and the rest is history. Not yet. <laughs> <laughs> history in the Yeah, we about to make it history. <laughs> wow, so, so you married this girl. Um, I mean... I mean, what did your family think after, you know, hearing you're going to marry a girl you knew for two months? Well, yeah, they thought I was crazy, and I uh, probably was. Um, but also, uh, the, uh, yeah, suddenly no one in my family, including my father, agreed that, that I should, should marry. I was told that almost, you know, almost kind of on his deathbed, he told you not to. Exactly. Yeah, on, on his deathbed, he... he Told me, um, not be careful, not to, not to marry this, this woman. Wow. I was so in love that I said, you know, what does he know? Yeah. <laughs> wow. <laughs> yeah, what does he know? What does he know? Well, well, he had his link in Two years later, I'm like, I should have listened to my father. Wow. <laughs> We, we in our track because she is a, a, a movie star, but here it is. This is the premiere of an island of paradise. I mean, I think she was winning. <laughs> yeah, yeah, she won. Trust me. <laughs> she won bigger than that day. <laughs> Don't worry, if our lawyers get their way, she'll really win. <laughs> okay, so so you met her. You know, you started calling up. When did things start going? I mean, no, sorry. Real question. How did, did your, um, your, your people perceive this marriage? Well, it, um, the, the marriage generally was not accepted by anyone in the Turks and Caicos. Mm. Uh, most people perceive it as a marriage of convenience. Mm. Uh, they perceive it that she married me more for the money, for the power, for the, the time the prestige. first lady, mm. and the prestige, and to and probably help her, her career that she was in. Uh, perhaps genuinely in love with me, or it's certainly not as in love with me as, as I was with her. Mm -hmm. um, and so it, it had a, a dramatic impact on my um, political uh, career in Turks and Caicos because I've all through my career been, been known as a people's man mm -hmm. um, to some extent because she lived in LA and we commuted. It, 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 took, it, 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 it um, caused me to be distracted mm. and to some extent, take my eyes off the. Of, of, of the uh, mm -hmm. of, of the prize, of the goal that, that um, we had set for, for the islands. Michael Misik has resigned as the Prime Minister of Turks and Caicos following an investigation that found signs of corruption during his time in office. We recently caught up with Lisa Ray on the set of Genuine's music video. There she talked about the former Prime Minister's reputation and calls for him to step down. I think for the betterment of the country with everything that he's going through, I, I think it's best to kind of step down and take a step back and kind of analyze what's going on and fight the fight that you need to fight and kind of step back up when you have kind of cleared the dust. 
Lisa Ray's well-publicized whirlwind romance with Missick began in 2005 after they met at an award show. Within a year, the two were married, making the U.S. star Lisa Ray an instant darling in the eyes of the people of Turks and Caicos. I do realize that me being the first lady of Turks and Caicos Islands has brought international news uh, and press there. You know, uh, perhaps it would have been a smaller story without me, but perhaps that was my reason for being there in the first place. And so I have to take that position and I have an obligation to the people and I have an obligation to myself. You know, maybe I was there to shed light on this, you know, mm -hmm. and so that is what I've done. Uh, island people are to some extent very conservative mm -hmm. and, and, and unassuming. And here comes this Hollywood actress that is sort of all flashy and glamorous and mm -hmm. uh, in your face. And, and, and uh, that didn't go down very well with um, the general population. And so I think it was the beginning of, of, of a, of a perception of a disconnect mm -hmm. between um, myself and, and, and the population, but also um, uh, to some extent, a large extent, it exposed our private uh, private life and, and brought unnecessary spotlight mm. on me as, as, as a leader. You were in the tabloids, man, because I, <laughs> I read some stuff where they even speculated that you were dating Eddie Eddie's Murphy's ex-wife or something like that. <laughs> Did you date Eddie Murphy's ex-wife? Uh. <laughs> <laughs> they didn't say much. They, they went on to say, well, we couldn't get that much information. Okay, I'm his lawyer. He pleads the fifth. I'll uh, put it this way. Uh, uh, she was not the only person from, from Hollywood I did. <laughs> 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 but but I, 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 I wonder. I have to read my book. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Part yeah. of the rest of it. <laughs> wow. <laughs> yeah, um, I, I want the, the men of the Bahamas, the Turks and Caicos, and the world to pay close attention to what this, what this gentleman just said. He said that this woman, this beautiful woman, distracted him. Think about it. Adam, perfect man. Woman brought him down. Samson, <laughs> the strongest man. Woman brought him down. Solomon, the wisest man. Woman brought him they down. Just, they just, they just trying to pop. Utah. It's building it. You shouldn't be saying this. <laughs> they can throw a rock at you, boy. Utah. Woman bringing him down next year. <laughs> but we can hear more of that later. <laughs> Mr. Michael Mizek, one of the greatest leaders the third world has ever seen. Woman brought him down. And for any shortcomings, I have had as your leader, I humbly apologize. Yesterday, a motion was, ma was made before the House for a vote of no confidence in my government, put forward by the opposition. This motion was not discussed on the floor of the House because it was time barred. Immediately prior to the commencement of the House, I was informed that a number of elected members from the PNP party were minded to support the motion, either by voting along with the opposition or through the absence during the voting process. Let me categorically state that I'm a proud Turks and Caicos Islander and a proud PNP. Um, so, all right, so you, you guys had a marriage. When did it start turning bad? When did you start, like, you know, cat fighting and that kind of stuff? Because well, I heard she beat you up. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think we really, I mean, I think that was stage for publicity. I, mm. yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm not a fighter, I'm a lover. <laughs> <laughs> Don't we know that? That didn't happen at all. Yeah. Um, but, you know, early in the marriage, uh, I realized that I made a mistake. Mm. But, um, and not, you know, it, it, and, and I made a mistake for all of the reasons that, that I mentioned before. Mm. And, um, you know, I, I'm not the type of person that, that talks ill of anyone. Mm -hmm. and so I wish her all the best uh, in, in, in her um, life and in her career. Uh, you know, we, we were married, and um, she is my ex-wife. So you, but you're, you're officially divorced? I am officially divorced. Okay. Yes. So did she get off? <laughs> <laughs> she's, uh, she's, she's fighting for more than half. <laughs> <laughs> but, yeah, we're, we're, we're officially divorced, and, and, I, and I wish her all the best. And um, it was a... Uh, yeah, learning, a learning experience for, 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 for me, um, and, uh, but I still believe in, in, in the institution of marriage, you know, I, mm. I believe it. Uh, so two months from now you may be no, going no, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> This time I, I, I will uh, 
listen to my, my, my father and, and uh, to the song that says, Take, Take time, time to know. know. <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir. Yes, sir.